Welcome to Tea Time with Brandon and Pat, and we're going to spill all the tea on your favorite celebrities. So where do we begin this week? Okay, so our girl Kim K, Kim oh, Kardashian sis. West, you know, had to <laughs> emphasize the West. Um, Kim Kardashian <laughs> West, her full legal name. Oh, anyway, uh, she is trying to be a lawyer. <laughs> um, where? Uh, yeah, exactly. She, yeah, <laughs> where? I, she's trying to pass the bar uh, by 2022, but I saw that it's for it's only like for like the state of California. Yeah, it's like a smaller bar. It's not like the actual like where you could use all over the U.S. or whatever. Yeah, so she's only gonna be like a California girl, basically. Yeah, <laughs> like she's Katie like Marian. stuck. <laughs> <laughs> she's stuck in this one little state and just won't be able to practice law. Yeah, which, I was about to say practice being a lawyer anywhere else. Yeah. <laughs> She's doing some good things. I'm not personally a fan of her at all, but I mean, she's doing some good things, I guess. Well, Kim has her ups and she has her downs with me, but like, I mean, this is like a step in like an adult way. Mm -hmm. So like, if she wants to be a lawyer in California, like, look, get it how you live, sis. Like, I'm commending her for that because that's a lot of work and she's actually putting in all this work to actually be a lawyer and like pass the bar by 2022. Like, Mm -hmm. she's grinding. Yeah, I mean, all props to her. I mean, yeah. Like I said, not a fan, but you know what? Do you, girl? Yeah. So Lori Laughlin, literally, girl, we have all the receipts, and like you're saying, like we're still not guilty, but it's like but you are. we have the proof, right? <laughs> there is literally proof in the pudding, right? Come on, sis. Like <laughs> I don't know. I commend Felicity Huffman, you know, for pleading guilty. So like, you know what? She owned up her for what she did, and it's like, okay, I did it. You know what? Let's move on. But the real tea is that they didn't appear in court. Like, their attorneys, like, filed this over to the judge and was just like, not guilty. And then they were just like, ha, we don't have to go to court today. So, like, I don't know. See, that already seems fishy to me. It does. Like, that just seems super sketch, and I don't know. I I love Lori as an actress, but as a person, I don't know. But even if they plead not guilty, they still get a minimum of four years in prison. So like, you're going to jail, girl, either way. No so matter you what. own up to it. Love you, sis, but bye. Okay, so what's left? Okay, so my girl, Tay-Tay, Taylor Swift, <laughs> uh, she has been releasing clues since last week about an upcoming something. Like, I think it's going to be a new single. It's going to be a whole new era. I'm super excited about it. And she's left and right because someone had said, like, she posted a picture with, like, rings on her fingers. And people were like, oh, my God, like, that's opals. Like, it's going to be, like, it's October. It's the birdstone. And, like, the album's coming out in October. And, like, it's, like, this whole thing. And I'm just like, I'm like, yes. Because, like, (laughs) as a super fan, like, I look into those little details. And I think the biggest one is that on Spotify today, uh, it says on their uh, 426 on every single one of Taylor's songs. It has, like, floating hearts and everything except Story of Us, which in the song she says next chapter Mm -hmm. and then she's been saying since november she was like i can't wait for the next chapter and in that song it is uh four minutes and 26 seconds long and the song comes out on april 26th we love a good time yeah (laughs) so taylor is the queen of this and i love when she does little hints like this taylor had this plan since story of us came out (laughs) okay honestly i would not be surprised like she's definitely been playing this since reputation probably came out yeah she knew but like here's my thing like i don't know where taylor is gonna go like she did the country she did the pop she did like the Rap. A little bit. Uh, and reputation. Rap, but <laughs> a little. Uh, yeah. Uh, and reputation. So, like, where is, like, this next album going to go or this next single going to go? Mm-hmm. Is it going to go back to a pop? Is it going to be a combination of all three country rap and pop? Is it going to feature Billy Ray Cyrus? <laughs> is it going to feature Miley Cyrus? Right. Which Cyrus is going to be in the song, Tay Tay? We don't know. <laughs> I, I don't know where it's going to go. I'm interested to see because the last like, couple albums she, like, fully went into pop and, like, while 1989 and Reputation were completely different, but like, I don't know, she could go back to her country roots like a little bit. I'm hoping. So I, I'd be down for that, mm-hmm. low key. Like, I'm down for anything. I love you, Taylor. You know what, I'm, you have me. We love country, <laughs> Tay-Tay. All right, guys, well, all the tea has been spilled this week. Make sure you tune in next Thursday for more Tea Time with Brandon and Pat.